welcome back. Our next characters are one of the reasons that make one Disney villain amongst one of the most famous ones. They're ruthless, tough, and reign supreme as the rulers of Neverland. These are Captain Hook's crew. Now there is no other group of pirates on the Seven Seas like these guys. When we first see them in Peter Pan, the guys are sick and tired of the captain and looking for Peter Pan. They just want to sail the seas again and leave Neverland for good. But then, when one of the pirates finally spots Peter with Wendy, John, and Michael, that's when they quickly turn to Hook's side. They will stop at nothing to get rid of Pan and the kids because they know that their reward will be to sail the seas again. They try to shoot them with a cannon, put a bomb in Hangman's tree and disguise it as a present for Peter and Wendy, even trying to recruit the Lost Boys and the Darling Children to become one of them. But they're not always ruthless and tough. While they were trying to set the bomb at Hangman's tree, they hear Wendy singing Your Mother and Mine. Apparently, the song is so moving, it even makes a tough pirate go on the verge of tears because it reminds them of their moms. Well, you know what they say. Pirate will love by our mommies and dads, drink up me hearty show ho! After Peter Pan, no matter where Hook goes, they go. They appeared in the sequel, Return to Neverland, where they do pretty much the same thing that they did in the first movie. Find him, and at least try to kill him. They also appeared by Hook's side in The House of Mouse, The Ride Peter Pan's Flight, the nighttime show Phantasmic at Disneyland, and in some parades. In Kingdom Hearts Birth of Sleep, Hook has an all-new crew made of many Heartlesses. The reason for the change has probably to do something with Hook's alliance with Maleficent. After all this, you may think the pirates are just nothing but groupies for Hook, and they just fill in the background for him. But in Epic Mickey, they have an all-new role to play. In the game, the crew were still the same pirates as we saw them in the movie, but that was before it happened. When Hook was transformed into a Beetleworks, the Wasteland version of the Terminator, there were several pirates that were transformed as well. Those who were still human escaped to Ventureland. Apparently, the machine that's turning the pirates into Beetleworks is in Skull Island. GO AWAY! Anyways, there are several pirates that you'll meet along the way, including Damien Salt, Gentleman Starkey, Scurvy Pat, Moody, and more. One problem with the pirates though is that, I don't know if the developers were lazy or something, but there's always a total of about four or five different pirates, and you can easily find duplicates of the same pirate. There's even one part where two of the same pirates appear next to each other doing the exact same animation. I know it's a lot of work, but if there is a next time, can you guys give us more of a variety of pirates? You know, so it doesn't look like Captain Hook's crew is made out of twins and triplets.